everybody welcome back to beauty's world today i'm going to be showing you these lip glosses and swatches and all that jazz so if you're ready for a full review on these me now lip glosses stay tuned <music> Also, all my swatches on my lips are mostly wet, so you're not really seeing the matte finish.
They can be a little bit sticky on the lips. You might wanna let it dry completely before like puckering your lips and all that. They can be very uncomfortable. As I'm sitting here talking to you guys, it don't feel too bad, but if I like went like that, it sticks together and that's really annoying. I don't know if it's cause it's not dry enough yet, but <laughs> they stick as you can see. They don't really have a wide range of colors. The colors more stick to pinks and reds. I wish they would branch off to like purples and blues and all those types of colors. But Please make sure you exfoliate your lips because this will show every crack, every dry skin on your lips. It will be very unattractive. So make sure you scrub your lips really good and put some kind of lip balm on before you put this to your lips, okay? Trust me. There is a lot of dupes in the line, so a lot of the colors look just alike. As you can see, this is number 20 and this is number 2, and they look almost alike. Except for number 2 is a tad bit lighter. Another thing that I do not like about these is that the packaging looks very cheap, of course. As you can see, they were only a dollar each, so what can you really expect? <laughs> These lip glosses have such a pretty finish and has such pretty colors, but the only thing is the formula sucks ass on me. The formula is so horrible on these lip glosses, oh my goodness. But you get what you pay for, it was only a dollar. If they had better formula, this would be up there with the Makeup Forevers and all the higher brands because these are very pigmented and very nice colors. Please make sure you check your teeth before walking out the door because these can stain your teeth and it is kind of hard to get off so you're going to have to really scrub it off like I just had to do. So make sure you do the finger in the mouth trick and make sure it's not getting on your teeth. They call this a long lasting lip gloss, but they should be called lip stains because they definitely stain the lips and they're very hard to come off. So it's kind of deceiving to call this a lip gloss. Some of these are not as pigmented as others, but they do look good on the lips nonetheless. It says that it's a lip gloss, but it's more like a liquid lipstick that dries to a matte finish. These lip glosses are waterproof. They're long lasting, so they would last all day. They're smudge proof and kiss proof. So they come in many different finishes. As you can see, this is more of like a frost finish or you can say maybe a glaze or something. They also come in a matte and set and finish also. These lip glosses don't really have a smell to them. So the colors match the colors on the tube very nicely. Another good thing about this is that it dupes a lot of brands in color wise. So this is a cheaper option for you if you don't want to spend tons of money on that same color. This is an option for you. You can purchase them separately or you can purchase all in a set. I've heard people complain about how long the shipping is on these. It takes like a month to two months to get these in the States, but I did get mine within a week and I got it off of eBay. I'll leave the link down below so you guys can get them if you want them. The shipping was very good for me, so that's something I did not have to deal with, thankfully. The best thing about these lip glosses is that it's only a dollar. One dollar you guys each so you can't beat that come on where can you find some liquid lipsticks that stays like it does and as pigmented as it is you get a lot of product for a dollar so great price show you guys how it does not budge as you can see I kissed my hand and nothing came off why oh, then just a little came off but as you can see it's not going anywhere and a paper towel and as you can see barely came off I mean this is like super hard to get off you can use a makeup wipe and all that stuff but it's really not gonna really work so like I said go in with a lip balm or something with the oil base and Put it on your lips, rub it on in there, and you can go straight away with the paper towel. And as you can see, pulled some off. As you can see, it does stain the lips, so if you don't like your lips to be stained, these are not for you. But I'm gonna go in with another layer of lip balm. Gonna let it sit for a couple of seconds, then I'm gonna wipe it away. And as you can see, mostly all of it came off. So it's not really a big issue getting it off, it's just, you know, you need something with the oil base. Is this worth buying? 
I would say, of course, it's only a dollar. They have a large color range. They have about 36 different colors. And the shipping that I got, it was quick, so you don't have to wait a long time. And for a beauty on a budget, this is a great deal. Even though there are some cons to it, I think the pros outweigh the cons, so. You just have to find a way to make it feel comfortable on the lips, which I'm still trying to figure that out. <laughs> All right, you guys, that is it with all my swatches. If you want to see some dupes on these, make sure you like this video, and I'll have that up for you guys very soon. And I will show you all the dupes that are out there that these are compatible with. So make sure you like this video. All right, you guys, that is it for my swatch fest. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'm already planning for my next swatch video. And I think you guys are going to love this one. So, yeah, that is it. Mwah. Bye. What, what was that? So these are liquid lipsticks that dries. These are lip. Next we have number seven, which is a nice like pinkish, which is a nice. Next we have number seven, which is a nice future, which is a nice fuchsia color. These colors, these lip glosses, these colors is that it's not enough. The only thing that I, that I don't really, that, oh, there is a lot of dupe. It's, Always remember to add a lip balm on to. Always remember to add a look. The good thing about this is the good thing about this is that it do is that it does dupe a lot of it does dupe a lot of oh I can't say this. It dupes a lot of it dupes a lot of I did find my but or you can buy them all separately. All kind of specks of colors in it. Really, really pretty. Or you can buy these lip glosses. These are lips. These are lip gloss. Some of these are not as pigmented. As, some of these are not as pigmented. Can I? Can I? Can I talk about this? I'm going in with the mocha brown.